What is going down, people of the YouTube? This is Sim with Vengeance, the mayor of Jam City, and I'm bringing you guys another NCAA 14 online dynasty featuring my team, the Ohio Bobcats. And today we have our third road game of the season in four games, too. And today we're taking on the Miami of Ohio Red Hawks. As you see, we give it off to Gerald Dickerson on the very first play, and he gets a gain of 16 on the play. Man, Gerald Dickerson, he is becoming such a boss. As you see right here on another run play, he's going to take it up the gut, showing his toughness, breaks a tackle, gets more tackles broken, gets enough of the first town plus a little bit more. Gain of 12, and he's got 28 yards to start off for his first two carries. Now later on, it's second and seven. We just passed midfield. Darius Vick back to throw, gets a completion of Landon Smith down in the 30-yard line, and we are rolling. The Ohio Bobcats offense so far on this first drive is looking spectacular. Now second and six, Vic back to throw, looks, gets a completion to Chase Cochran. How he got that completion, I don't know, but we'll take it at second and goal. Hand off to Gerald Dickerson, and he's going to do the rest. Falls backwards into the end zone. Touchdown, Ohio. It is 7-0 as Gerald Dickerson was the man of the drive. But now it is the Miami of Ohio's turn. Let's see what they could do on the second and five here. As you see, their quarterback's name is Cummer. That's just, I, I don't even, I don't even know how to explain that. I mean, come on, name generator. You got to think of better names than that shit. I mean, come on. His last name is Cummer. Ah, oh, so many things wrong with that. Come on, name generator. Come on, man. But anyway, he's back to throw here. He's got a third down and 10, but his running back, Jameer Westbrook, is not going anywhere past that, <laughs> that marker. And we're going to get the ball back. It's second and 16 here for the Ohio Bobcats. And Darius Vick changing the play. He's back to throw. You see there's a flag on the field, but it is caught by Jimmy Lewis. It does not matter what that flag is because it's on the defense. We did decline because it was offsides. So third and 13 here. We're going to see what we could do again. Darius Vick throws a screen pass, but the defense is right there to swarm on the ball, and they're going to get the ball back. And look where we get them to start at. They start at the five-yard line here. It's second and 11, and we're going to see what they could do right here. You see the number 53 right there lined up as a tight end, and usually people who wear number 53 are offensive linemen, and that's what he is. Terry Davis, look at that big fella right there getting that big catch. Look at that offensive lineman. <laughs> if you've ever seen the replacements, I love it when a fat man scores. You get a fat man touchdown and a fat man dance. But anyway, first and 10, their quarterback, I'm not going to even say his name anymore. His, his name shall not be spoken of because I feel like I'm going to get flagged for something inappropriate. But anyway, second and seven here for the Miami of Ohio. They handed off play action, actually. He's back to throw and... And that is a pick six, and it's 14 to nothing, Ohio. Now they're back on defense again for another third down and five. We're going to see if they can get a first down and get something going. Their quarterback's back to throw. He's looking, and... Can you believe that, ladies and gentlemen? Two straight possessions with two interceptions, and we're up 14 to nothing, looking to go up 21. We get it off to Chase Cochran here for a gain of 21 on the play. And we're looking to score once again. Now third and four for the Ohio Bobcats. 3.28 left in the second quarter. Darius Vick back to throw. He's looking. He gets the completion to Ryan Coleman down to the five-yard line. Nice completion. Nice catch by Ryan Coleman, the freshman. And now it's first and goal here. The very next play. We're going to see what we could do. Hit read option. Darius Vick is going to keep it himself. And he's going to score. Touchdown, Ohio. It is now 21 to nothing. Now let's see what the Miami of Ohio offense can do as they have been looking like garbage. Now you see their quarterback back to throw. He's looking. He's running out of time, and he goes down for the sack. Antoine Crutcher, the All-American, comes up with the sack. Now here comes the Ohio offense once again. Darius Vick gets a quick completion to Jimmy Lewis. Gets enough for the first down. Jimmy Lewis doing his thing in this game, even though he only has two catches, but he is contributing. That's a great thing. Darius Vick back to throw. Gets the completion to Landon Smith. Gets just enough for the first down as we're looking to get another score before halftime. Second and two now. Minute and three seconds left. Hand off to Gerald Dickerson. And he barely, I don't even know if they, I don't even know if he got the first down or not, but they gave it to him. I don't know why, but they did. So second and one here. 
We got Dasman Patterson in the backfield. We're going to look. We're going to get the completion to Chase Cochran, and he's in the end zone. Touchdown, Ohio. It's 28 to nothing. Looking like another repeat of last week when we faced Idaho when we beat him 66 to nothing. And you see third and 25 here for Miami of Ohio, and they're going nowhere. So that's going to be the end of the half, and it is going to be 28 to nothing. They get the ball to start the third quarter, third and 13. Let's see what they could do. They got to get something started here. They see their quarterbacks back to throw. He's looking deep, and it is caught. Oh, my God. It's caught for a gain of 36. You guys expected another interception, but that was a that was a great catch by Frazier, and he comes down with it first and 10 for Miami of Ohio. They get another completion to Frazier. Frazier making some big catches in this second half so far. Two big completions down the field, and they're primed to score. First and 10 for the Miami of Ohio Redhawks. Back to throw as their quarterback. He looks, and... Mike, Mike. Nice interception by Nathan Carpenter. Man, that was a nice one. Tippy toes it in, and you see Darius Vick tippy toeing himself, and he gets a first down for Ohio as we're looking to take a 35 0 lead. Now, second and three here. We're going to see what we can do. We're going to hand it off here to Daz Patterson, even though I do not like handing the ball off to him. But he does get on the line, and he does get a first down. So I really can't complain there. So, second and six now. We got Darius Vick back to throw. Looking, gets a quick strike to Landon Smith. He is playing such a big role for this offense this year. You see him making about four, five, six catches a game so far this year. Now, first and ten. Darius Vick back to throw. Scrambling, looking, gets the completion to Chase Cochran. Gets the first down, gain of 13 on the play. Chase Cochran really doing his thing this year. He has the big responsibility of handling the first string, and he's handled it pretty well. You see, off to Landon Smith. I thought he was on the line, but they called it short, so it's fourth and one. We're going to go for it. Why not? You know, we're that close to, the, to getting the first down and that close to the end zone. You might as well take a chance, especially since you're up by 28, right? Or you can just take the points and just move on. But I just had to go for it. Hand off to Gerald Dickerson. And he does not disappoint. Gets the first down inside the five-yard line. And we are looking to score once again. As you see, Gerald Dickerson's nearing 100 yards. So second and goal here. Off to Dickerson again. Gets himself in the end zone. Touchdown, Ohio. It is now 35-zip. Now it's Miami of Ohio's turn to try and get themselves on the board. Now you see their quarterback back to throw. Throws it again to near Kristoff. Gets the completion to Orlando David. And he gets a first down. You see that quarterback stat line not very good. Three interceptions. No touchdowns, obviously. And you see why that they're getting blown out 35 nothing Because those turnovers. Turnovers can kill just about any team. Unless, you know, you're forcing the turnovers yourself, too, on the other end. So you see their quarterback back to throw again. He gets it. Oh, my God. Another interception by Donovan. Nice catch by Donovan. There's no mines there. I only allow three per video if that so allows it. But in this case, you know, we've passed our three. So <laughs> we're just going to say interceptions for the rest of the game, okay? So we're going to try and get the ball to Dickerson. And, and in tight situations like this on the third and ten, you know I'm going to pass. Try and get the first down and do what I need to do to possibly, you know, get this game you know over with but you see right there I failed to do so complete on third down and we're gonna give the ball back to Miami Ohio so they got a third down and 10 right here with 435 left in the fourth their quarterbacks back to throw I still refuse to say his name because I don't want to get flagged but anyway <laughs> gain of 21 on the play through Orlando David and that stat line still it's still pretty bad four interceptions 13 to 24 and third and 10 here for Miami of Ohio quarterbacks back to throw again he throws a screen pass but our defense is right there to make the stop. Only a gain of two yards for Jameer Westbrook. And we're going to get the ball. Or actually, no, they're going to go for it. Never mind. It is the fourth quarter. They're going to try and get on the board. You see right here, easy completion to Scott. And Dewan Scott gets the first down. Now they're near the red zone once again. This is like the third time they've been near the red zone. But they failed to score still. So 330 left. The quarterback's back to throw again. He looks, and it is picked off by Carpenter for the second time in this game. That's five interceptions. Uh, yes, this is still All-American difficulty. I, I cannot make this shit up. Like, really, this is just this is just terrible quarterback play by the, the Miami of Ohio quarterback. 
I, I wouldn't be surprised if there was a quarterback controversy next year. So if, we're going to try and get Gerald Dickerson over 100 yards now. That's pretty much the goal. But you see right here, we're going to pass on third and 11 just so I can get that first down. Darius Vick back to throw. Looks, gets the completion to Chase Cochran, as always, with his most reliable hands on the game with a catching attribute of 95. I would say he has the most reliable hands. So we give it off to Gerald Dickerson, gain a seven, and you see right here he's just past 100 yards, and we do end up winning the game. Final score 35 nothing. We are now three and one on the season, and we're looking to become four and one as next week we are taking on Akron, who is still controlled by its JDB 330 or AKA Amazing 2K Cinema. But you see we have our second straight shutout. We're gonna look for a third straight next week, as we're gonna try and shut out John. But I highly doubt that's going to happen. It's pretty hard to shut out a user. But we're going to try our best anyway. But anyway, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. If you are a first-time viewer of myself, please subscribe. Also, stop by my second channel, Old School Sin, if you are into Let's Plays. Also, check out my other videos as well if you haven't done so, like the new Fab Five, uh, MLB 13 The Show, uh, and my Road to Glory in NHL. And one thing about... Uh, my PS4 problem, I probably won't get to get it till later because I got bills to pay. So expect NBA Live to come a little bit later than expected. Uh, I wanted to do it on release date, but I guess that's not going to happen. But I'm not too concerned about it, although I'm really excited about NBA Live when I do get it. So again, thank you guys for watching. Make sure to subscribe. Make sure to leave a like on this video. But until next time, my name is Sim with Vengeance, and I am the mayor of Jam City, and I am out of here. Peace.